Hello everyone, it's Girl in Minecraft, and I am back with some more of my Perfect Genetics challenge. So, um, I was thinking about some stuff, and uh, I'm actually going to have her look into adopting a pet from the shelter, because she's still at the library. I haven't really, like, played at all since last time. And, um, I was kind of thinking about Charlie. He wants to earn a university degree with a perfect GPA, so... I don't know if I had talked about this before, but um, I'm thinking my plan for him is that uh, once their kid is born um, and like either they're working on the next batch, <laughs> you know, <I> batch, <laughs> but uh, either they're working on trying to have more kids just in case or like what, but he's going to probably go um, to his university. Um, because he's only he's only level two in his career right now, but if he goes to university and gets like um, I think it's the physical education degree. Um, if we do that, I think it'll get him. He can start at like level six or something. Like he can start a lot higher in the career. So I might just send him off to university, um, probably sooner rather than later. Like he can he can get up in this career pretty fast like on his own but since that's his lifetime wish i think i'm just gonna try and get him um on that but yeah <laughs> i love the name tigger I, I wonder if it's actually an orange cat oh no it's not oh and it, it's destructive and a piggy Oof. nah this is kind of a cute cat so if we were to get a cat that's probably what i would pick i don't know if i want them to have a cat or a dog I don't know. It just depends really on the options, I guess. A schnoddle. Aw, I've really never had that breed. A mutt. Damn, I would love for them to have like a German Shepherd or something. I wish I wish you could um in create a pet. I wish you could create puppies. Cause like I want I want them to start out with a puppy, but like Yeah. Hyper aggressive genius. Uh I think we'll pass on the pets for now. I'm not really feeling any of the options. I was kind of liking that black and white cat, but I don't want to, like, force it, you know? Um, let's see. What was she doing here? I already forgot. I think she was, um, she was working on skills or something. Um, let's see. What are her skills? So, she does have a little bit of alchemy. That might have been what I was doing. Because if she wants to do alchemy, also, she has no gardening. Okay, let's get her, um, let's get her doing gardening. Because if she's going to learn alchemy, she'll need to garden. He has a, a little bit of gardening skill, and he has no alchemy skill. So, it's going to probably be her thing. So, it's only 12 p.m. She's fine. Um, let me have her use the bathroom first, though, because she's probably not going to be able to sit down and do this for very long if she has to pee no idea if these are gender specified they are okay let's go in there and then come back up here and read am i blind where's gardening wait is there no gardening books in here hello why not weird hmm huh. Um, I suppose... Oh, we have one on her. Okay, well, that's fine. She'll just read that then. I might place some more um, stuff in here. So, hold on. Let me go to Edit Town. I want to place a couple more other, like, those bookshelves um, that actually have... Oops, my, my B. I didn't mean to do that. I meant to just go and build. Um... Yeah, I might place a couple other bookshelves that actually have, like, skill building stuff in them. So, let me just delete that one and that one, and let's get some bookshelves. Da -da -da. Bookshelves, um... Hmm, I don't know if that... that might have been one. Here, let me go and see if I can figure out which ones of these. Are the ones I'm looking for because I know this one is definitely a skill bookshelf and there's another one that I'm thinking of I don't know about that one there's a couple that usually have I, this might be one of them 
trying to remember. I'm going to do one of these. And I'm going to do another one of these down right here. And then I'm going to do the same on the other side and just kind of mirror that design. Hopefully that other bookshelf is the one that I, I want. Because I know one of these, like, it, it looks similar to this. And it's like, it's one that has skill building books and stuff. Skill books, rather. But yeah, let me see if I can make these patterns match. Oops. Hopefully I didn't just do the wallpaper by accident. <laughs> that would be something that I would do. Yes, I did. <laughs> I knew it. I had a feeling that I just did the wallpaper. <laughs> Oh wait, it's still it's still messed up. Okay, I'll fix it in a second. Do that. There we go. For some reason I it didn't copy. Let me just put that back. <laughs> okay. And then I just wanna make them all the same color so they look like they were meant to be here. Alright, you're good, you're good. Okay. And let's go back to the game. At some point, I think it would be fun to do a series where, oh, hello. Why are you home now? Madame. Not sure why you TP'd home. Um, gosh, where's, where's the library? Here it is. I'm gonna teleport her back because she was at the library and the game glitched, so... Ah, uh, no, that's not one, okay. But this one has- oh, this one has gardening now. Weird, what the heck? That was weird. Not sure why, um... Oh, she's using the hoverboard. Hey, I guess it gives her skills. She's not even that far. I forgot we lived super close. Also, hello. Who are all these people? <laughs> I like how nobody's at the library until we are there. She's really cute. Who are you? Ellen Reed? We need to be friends. She needs girlfriends. <gasps> also, you are gorgeous. Hello? Felicia Lynn? Wow, dude. What the heck? What is up with my game? Why do I now have, like, attractive sims in my game? Okay. Also, <laughs> she has... <laughs> okay, so <laughs> she has... <laughs> she has this staff. Uh, which is some custom content that I downloaded because on Twitch I'm doing a Disney Legacy, Disney Legacy challenge. And for the current generation, um, my Sims have... My Sim... I'm playing, um, like, Sleeping Beauty. Um, and... <laughs> I just realized she could just listen to her tabcast. But yeah, anyways, I, so I made a Maleficent Sim. And, of course, I gave her a staff. <laughs> Now random sims are using it, so that's that's great. It's fabulous. Alright, anyways. Um, she wants to join the garden decree. No, ma'am. If anything, we might be able to just do, like, self-employed advanced technology or something. I don't know. It's not a thing. Uh, reach level 6. Yes, ma'am. You will indeed. What are the... What are some skill things... Digital dreamer. Dreams can have a profound effect on a sim's day. Become a digital dreamer by having 50 unique dream outcomes and dream pod dreams will always begin with a good dream. Hmm. Okay. Um. Synthesize. Being a digital chef isn't just about pressing a few buttons on the food synthesizer. It's about pressing a lot of buttons. It's about pressing a lot of buttons. <laughs> Program a recipe onto 20 unique food synthesizers and you'll receive the ability to pro program food synthesizers to improve food quality to level 4. Interesting. So you have to like... You have to program 20 different synthesizers? Is that what I'm saying? Because that's crazy. Uh, asking for a sprite form from others is a great way to increase your sprite collection. Collect all 10 sprites on the holodisc and receive an 11th sprite. <gasps> Oh, a bonus sprite. Interesting. Okay. Well, if we get really bored, we might do something like that. That'd be cool. But yeah. Bow, bow. Also, hello. Serious fragments three and four. Hmm. Forgot we had those. I was like, 
What are those? <laughs> Kona beans, Maui beans look very similar. One is slightly browner than the other one, though. All right, so we have all of these lovely things that we can plant once she gets her skills up. Uh, but yeah, once their uh, kid is born and possibly like once they're a toddler, um, I'll probably be having him go to university to get his first degree. Well, his degree, um, rather. And he wants a perfect GPA, so we're going to have to do a really good job at it. All right, he earned 382. No promotion, but he's very close to getting a promotion. Um, but, like I was saying, I might have him, like, quit and reapply after he gets his GPA or his um, diploma because I think he'll get up several levels than he is right now. Okay, so he must have been doing the gardening then. I Sorry, I haven't played this household in a few, so I'm just, like, lost right now. Like, who is gardening? We do have a garden, but somebody was doing it and it wasn't you. Alright, you need to work out, eh? Well, I suppose we could send you to the gym then, because she's not home and there's nothing for you to do there. Something going on there, I guess. Um, that's the military. There's the gym. There it is. Come on down. Let's see. What do we got? We got showers and shit. We got the pool. Can't really get athletic from the pool, sadly. Although that would be cool. And that kind of rhymes. Alright. Yeah, let's get you working out. Let's do uh, Don't Break a Sweat. Because currently he doesn't have any special workouts. Uh, eventually I'll have him do like the longer ones, like good pacing and push self and such like. Alright, how is your alchemy going? She's about to level up, which should put her at the end of that book. Yep. And then, let's have you listening to Gardening again, and then read Alchemy Volume 2. So she will be making the elixirs. Ooh, there's a romance book. Alright, Letitia has just improved her alchemy, almost said athletic, uh, skill to level 3. And he got his athletic skill to level 3. <laughs> nice. Alright, now he has good pacing. So we can get him to work out super long. Alright, he's working out till 9.30, which is fine because he doesn't have work tomorrow or the next day, which is a good thing because we're definitely going to be having this baby any momento. Are people kissing right now? They are. Oh, what the? Hello? Oh, just, just getting it on in the freaking library. They have like the same eye color? Almost. Like, they both have very light blue eyes. Hers are more like gray than his, but like. <laughs> is this like a Lannister situation? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, where are you guys going? What are you doing? Alright. Yeah, break it up. Get a room. Let's go back to. My, my guy here. Alright. So, um, bets on how many kids they're gonna have to have until... <laughs> also, I like how there's a light, like, directly behind his head. That seems safe. Anyway. But, bets on how many kids they're gonna have to have before, uh... <laughs> they have their heir. I'm just gonna get a thumbnail pick right now. <laughs> looking cute, looking cute. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> it looks so. Oops! <laughs> I meant to move the camera, not take another pick. Anyway. I wanted to get a nice picture of him just working out, but then he had to fall on his face. There we go. Just in case. I, I need options, you know. So that 
We got lots of options. I'm probably gonna be taking a pic of like, you know, her giving birth or holding the baby or something. So yeah, work it until fatigued. Absolute mess. You will. You will be fatigued. Don't you worry, my friend. All right, it's nine o'clock. He's probably gonna be going home soon. Yeah, he's getting real tired. Um, excuse me. There we go. <laughs> if I wanted a map view of my sim, I would have just gotten a map view. <laughs> All right, she's getting close to topping out her skill. I think that. She can head home now, too. It's about to be... Oh, to be really late. Alright, work out for six hours. Not today. Maybe next time. Alright, they're gonna just go home. Meet in the middle. Probably hoverboarding. Awesome. It's cool that they're um, getting their skills every time they go somewhere. Alright. But yeah, uh, I think I was saying earlier. I think it'd be fun to... To do, like... A series where I make over all the EA towns and I just kind of customize like all the all the lots and things to be a little more interesting because um there's there's some towns really lack <laughs> like like you go to the you go to the community lots and stuff and there's like barely anything to do and it's like like the like even like the little like hangout lots and like the the bars and stuff there's like, there's like nothing. It's so, it's so sad. So, so yeah, I was kind of thinking it'd be fun to do that. Um, there we go. You take a shower. Oh man, it's a storm. It's such a stormy town. Aurora skies. It's probably the only like downside of this. To oh man, she's having the baby. Okay, I would kind of want her to have a home birth. Um, so if you could go here. Because I don't want him to trigger the, um, oops. I don't want him to trigger the, uh, the, like, taking her to the hospital. Yeah, go to bed. You don't need to take a nap, just go to bed. <laughs> He'll probably be pulled to the hospital in a second anyway, so. <laughs> now I've got to get a picture, of course, so, you know. Ew, what is this wallpaper I chose? Disgusting. I can't believe you guys let me pick this gross looking wallpaper. Alright, we got a pick. <sighs> you sleeping? Also, I heard somebody sigh. Who's there? Hello? Ghosts? Alright, cool. Perfect. Just what I always wanted. See, so yeah, if I don't get a pet beforehand, um, I was kind of thinking when we had the air, it'd be cute to like give them a pet, you know? Is it like a birthday gift or something? I don't really want to have like too much, too much in the household because if we end up having a lot of kids, we're gonna have to be upgrading this house a lot, and um, I don't want to have like a pet on top of it all, you know? Because a lot of times there's oops, they have social needs that get out of hand. <laughs> but anyways, all right, so I, all right, so we've got a boy. All right, and so the baby made it through smoothly. The baby has been born with the disciplined and trait, and you will get to choose the second trait. All right, so we have a disciplined baby, and with an unknown second trait so far. All right, um, what shall we name him? His name shall be. Let's name him Roy. Because as a child, my favorite um, movie, my my favorite actor in a lot of movies was Roy Rogers. I loved Roy Rogers' Cowboy movies. That was my childhood and I also kind of had a small crush on him even though I shipped him and Dale Evans super hard. <laughs> All right, anyways. Uh, disciplined and loves the outdoors traits. So, pretty, pretty cool. Nice, they might be a good prospect for... <gasps> they have the hair. Oh my God, my child, the first child has the hair. If we have the air first time, I'm going to have a cow. Like, I don't even know how to feel about that. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. It's, it's way too easy. We can't have the air this fast. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
Guys, we already have a baby with the hair. He's winking. Wait, I have to get a pic of him winking. Oops. Kind of. There we go. He has the hair. Don't like having this swing in the way. Also, cleavage. <laughs> Not the cutest angle for her, but... Uh, okay, I'll just do with the both of them. There we go. <laughs> Thanks for your patience while I take 10,000 thumbnail pics. But yeah, um, if we have the air already, I don't know how to feel about this, y'all. I think we'll wait. Well, I'm thinking we're going to wait on having more kids. I guarantee this kid is not the heir. But I am going to have them wait. Because... If I can have one child, and I don't need to have more, that'd be super dope. Super dope. I'd be into that. I've never gotten to play a perfect genetics generation and only need to have one kid, so yeah. He already looks like an adult. Like, this kid looks sophisticated as hell. Let's give him uh, some little accessories. I like, um, I like doing different stuff to the kid, the baby's, like, outfits. I kind of want to give him the wisps instead of, um, <laughs> let's give him a beard. <laughs> okay. Uh, every day. Little dinos, little onesie, little burrito. Is there any other ones for this one? Yeah, there's like a little bear, a little giraffe. Aw, I like the little giraffe. But I want to change the colors, so once this loads. Loady, loady, load. Whenever you're done. It's not even that. Wow. Now we gotta wait for this one to load. Alright, I'll be back in a second, guys. Okay, so finally loaded. Um, let's give him... Oops, oops. Um, I kind of want to see what it looks like with this color. Let's give him, like, a little green shirt. Like a baby pastel green. Sort of. <laughs> and then let's give him... Do like dark green. Yeah, okay. And yeah, that's all he needs for like outfit. I don't usually do multiple outfits just because they're only gonna wear one outfit as an infant. They don't ever like they don't ever do clothes changes. I love these little hats and things. I kind of want to put one on him, but I also kinda don't just because I want to show off oh there's a little bandana that I have too. I want to show off his cute blue hair. Um, yeah, no hat. Let's do this pacifier and let's get him... I don't remember which ones are which. Let's do this one. They're kind of like Disney or something. They're dis different Disney characters, I think. Let's see, which one did he get? Is it just plain? Okay, yeah. I think one of them was like Disney characters and then one of them was just plain colors, so. He's cute! Aww. Little munchkin and he's got the hair. We don't know what his eye color is yet, but we will find out. So we have little Roy here. Uh, Charlie's sleeping and she is ready to go to sleep too, so I'm just gonna have her go to bed. She had... A long day of skill building and then she gave birth so yeah I'll see you guys when they wake up all right so excuse me already burping Charlie is awake um, he's gonna go meet his little squish that his wife brought into the world last night after he was asleep so why don't you go give him a bottle Oops. and then snuggle him and play with him and snuggle him again. Just become friends with your little baby. 
He doesn't like children, but, you know, it's kind of hard not to love your own little, little, little squish that you had. So, yeah, getting him fed. Maybe we'll give him a diaper change. I mean, he's doing pretty good right now, so. Yeah, we'll put, put him back in the swing. Just getting to know him a little bit. Getting to getting to, to meet him. She's already friends because she had him at home. Uh, if you have your if Sims have their babies at home, they are already friends. If you have them at the hospital, they don't get as much relationship. So it's kind of why I wanted to have them at home, or at least him. You can have future gener future children at home as well. Looks like he got his imaginary friend. All right, I'm gonna save real quick. I'll be right back. Okay. He wants to improve his gardening skill. <laughs> like how he's just walking around outside in his underwear. No biggie. Alright, so Roy has his imaginary friend now. Congrats, Roy's toy. Kind of rhymes. <laughs> Alright, why don't you... You're doing pretty good. Change to every day. Are you sleeping or napping? She's sleeping. Okay, she's already t she's already like rested though. Weird. It says she's sleeping till twelve, but she doesn't need to. Um, yeah, she's she's pretty good on needs as well. Every day, and then go here. I'm gonna have them interact a little bit. All right. Oh, listen to compliment. Damn, she's like. Not even wasting a second. She's already flirting. Alright. Emra's hug. Oh, he's complimenting her appearance too. She just gave birth and he's just like, Girl, you still look fantastic. Alright. Confess to watching you while you sleep. I don't know why that's a weird thing. Because like... Oops. I mean, I guess it depends on your relationship with somebody. But sometimes watching people sleep... Like, like, if, like watching your spouse sleep or something and be like, oh, because you love them, you know. Uh, it's not really a job, weird thing, uh, but I guess it depends on the person. But it's such a negative thing in this game. It's like, <gasps> creep. And I'm like, okay. Alright, talk about rebelling. Talk about gardening. Talk about... Share secrets. What secrets do you got, boy? Talk about tell her, tell her a dramatic story. Have you heard Johan Reed has been flirting with Elin Reed? Was that the couple? That was the blonde couple that we saw at the um, at the the, 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 the the library. Oh my gosh! Alright, he wants to kiss her. Hopefully, he doesn't lose that wish. And flirt with her. Compliment her appearance. Uh, yeah, you guys can woohoo. I once ate uncooked waffles on a dare. Oh man. You mean waffle batter? That that's what a one cooked waffles is. It's just batter. <laughs> Aw. You awake, little little munchkin? Can, do you have blue eyes? They don't look blue right now, but. Are they blue? Do you have blue eyes? Well, she has blue eyes too. So there's a pretty high chance. <laughs> I guess they're more green than blue, but either way, this kid's gonna be cute. If it had like her eyes with the hair, that would also be really cute. But we prefer the green eyes because um, we kind of need the perfect genetics child, so. <laughs> All right, let's woohoo in our fancy dream pod. I like how it gets this, like, game screen. It's cool. Alright, maybe they'll go on, like, a date or something. Or maybe they could go to the future together. Hug amorously. Alright, alright, alright. So, go here, go here. And then, oops. Amorous hug. Sure. No. His face looks so derp. Oh my god, I just got even derper. 
as I said that, he just went. Rawr. <laughs> okay. Um, can you improve meal quality? Ooh, we can. Can we? No, I can't make another recipe. A darn. All right, eat some leftovers. Baked angel food cake. Food cake. Yes, food cake. Apparently. And you have some as well. All right. So we got this whole weekend to enjoy our baby. <gasps> you know what would be really cute? Oh my gosh. Okay. I haven't used this item in a long time. But with Generations, there is a, a, a baby stroller. So let's see. This one. This is the one for really little babies. I think it'd be so cute to get them a little stroller. Aww. Okay. Let me just change the colors. Like, I, I like the blue. I kind of want to go more green. And then this is really fugly. So I'm gonna... Gonna just change that to... Um, like, gray or like black or something. There we go. And then I kind of want to change this to a lighter color. Yeah, I love it. Okay, there's their stroller. I want I want them to go on a little walk together. So we gotta go on a stroll with Roy. I wish we could go as a group, but we can't, unfortunately. Actually, yes. Yeah, socialize. Give him some social real quick. Alright, yeah, you clean up real quick, and then um, yeah, you take care of his needs. Change him real quick. Alright, she's gonna play on her laser in the con for a second while he gets Roy <clears throat> ready to go. Alright. He's good, freshly powdered, feeling a little snooty with your freshly powdered booty. And he's squeaky clean. Alright, perfect. And then, let's go on a stroll. Alright, let's go to... Let's go on a stroll with Roy. And then you can clean that, use that, and... Hey, since you have some handiness stuff going on, you could upgrade some things. I thought it said he needed to clean that for a second. I was like, ooh, if we can clean that, that's something he can do. Alright, get some handiness. And then upgrade this to Unbreakable. Might as well get that going. We don't need a Bone Hilda, I'm good. <laughs> Alright, let's go on a stroll with our little munchkin. Aww. So precious. And it's like sunset too. <clears throat> Just a little sunset stroll. Adorable. I love it. Can this family get any cuter? Probably. But I refuse to acknowledge it. <laughs> Aww. He's so happy. Just a happy little squish. There's our house looking weird. Weird as hell. There we go. <laughs> Look at him. He loves it. And he loves the outdoors. So this is this is his jam, you know. Going outside for a little stroll with mommy. On day two of being in the world. <laughs> Very realistic. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, Lynn. Oh my god, we just got hit by a car. We're dead. Um, do we? Hmm. Valquist. We didn't meet those people in the library, but I kind of want to. S Reed. Wait, wasn't Reed their last name? Or am I crazy? Because I want them to meet. I want her to meet that couple. Oh, wait, is that the gym? What? What the heck? Is this like another gym? 
Because we went- yeah, we went to this gym. There's like a- oh, there's a gym a lot closer. I didn't see that originally. Interesting. Okay. Um, there's the Oss household. Nobody, nobody. It's a bar. Olsen, Valquist. Store, Svard. That's our house. <laughs> um, town hall, obviously. Hmm. Flux would like to come out and play. The ghost of Emil Haas. Emil Olsen has finally lost a grip on the motor realm. Why are you telling me this? Because... Was it somebody we witnessed dying or something? We have no connection with them, so I really don't have any particular feelings about whether or not they go to the netherworld. <laughs> Alright. Yeah. Going on a little stroll. Aw, had a good stroll. Fresh air, beautiful sights, and some exercise. What could be better than a good stroll? From Stroller. Yay! Warm fuzzies from Angel Food Cake. Okay. Take your baby home. <laughs> Alright. Let's walk home. Not super far down the road, so it shouldn't take them terribly long, hopefully. Um, but yeah. Alright, he is working on upgrading that. And he's got his handiness t tab cast. I don't know why I like went all weird there. Sometimes I can't speak straight. But yeah. I'm actually going to end this part here. This has been kind of fun. We had our little Roy. He's getting hungry, yeah. We had our little Roy, and um, we just had a nice part getting skills spilt, and little Roy's just got run over a few times already. Awesome. And uh, pretty soon, I'm going to be hopping over to Charlie, and we're going to be taking him to university. Uh, once Roy turns into a toddler, um, if he's not the heir, we'll have them woohoo and try for a baby again. And then... Um, you know, we'll have that going. And then, oops, he's, I just wanted to see who this sim is. Because if that's a guy, is that the guy? No, he's a different guy. Okay, and he's also part of Barazzi. Alright, but yeah. But yeah, so, so if he's not the heir, we'll have them try for a baby, and then I'll send him to university anyways. Because nothing, time's going to freeze, basically, when he goes there. So it won't really matter. Um, but I don't want to, like, leave her alone with, like, 20,000 kids, so. Um, you know, if she just has the one kid to take her, that's fine while he goes to university. And, yeah, but if he is the heir, then I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it either way, <laughs> basically. If he is the heir, then awesome, and we're good to go, and we can just focus on their lifetime wishes, basically. Getting them, uh, getting her to level 10 in advanced technology is the goal. She's level 4, we have a lot to go. Um, but yeah, just, just, uh, just focusing on making them the happiest they can be. And I'm excited that we have a potential heir. <laughs> Who knows? Is he the heir or isn't he? Gotta find out in the next part. <laughs> See you guys later.